Hello, and welcome to your Explain Everything tutorial. Let's start by opening the app. This is what the icon looks like. Once in the app, we're going to want to press the plus button in the top left hand corner. You can see it here. When I press it, you get to choose the type of template you would like to use. I will just use this one. Now let's take a look at what all the functions are of the toolbars and tools inside the Explain Everything app. Working our way down, we first have a hand. The hand is used to manipulate objects on your screen. We then have the pencil tool. If you press the icon, it selects it, and now I can write. If I press it again, it will have a drop down menu. I can choose a different sized pencil. Below that, we have the highlighting tool. If I change the color from my template below, you'll see that the color of my highlighter also changes. Our next button is shapes. So we can create shapes using Explain Everything. Let me select it. Now, once this tool is open, you'll see that we have the circle square, arrow, some lines, and a star. Let's say I want to make a circle. All I have to do is select the circle, press on the screen away, hold my finger, and drag to make the size of circle I wish to have. Now you'll notice, once I've let go, that my hand tool is highlighted again. This means I can manipulate any object I wish to manipulate on my screen. I can also shrink and grow by pinching my fingers. We can also use the typing tool. So here I've highlighted the A, I'll press it again, and you'll see that I have a menu open. I can choose my font, my font size, whether I have a border or if I group it with all the other things on my screen. Let's press away from that menu. I'll press on the canvas once again, and now I can start typing. Hello once again. I'll tap away from that screen, and I'll tap away once more, and you'll see that my hand tool is highlighted once again. Now I can maneuver everything on my screen again. Below the A, you'll notice the plus symbol. This means you can add photo, video, sound, or take a new photo or video from your camera. Let's add a photo from my camera roll. Let's add the planet Earth. You'll see here that a screen opens up that allows you to crop or edit your image. But for now, I'm going to press Done. Again, I can now manipulate this drawing. If I'd like to delete something, I simply have to press on the X here you'll see below the plus sign. If I press it, nothing happens. But let's select something on my screen. You'll notice now that a box appears around all of the writing, and a red X appears in the top right hand corner. Let's press that red X, and it deletes everything. Uh oh, what happens if I didn't want that to happen? Well you'll notice down here, an undo button. Let's press it. Whew, I got lucky there. Let's delete something else. Underneath the delete button, you'll notice what looks like a target. This is our pointing tool. You'll see here that I selected the lightsaber. If I press it again, my menu will open. So I get to choose which color lightsaber I'd like to have, which way it points. I can also just choose a single dot, an arrow, or a hand. If you choose to offset it, that simply means that it'll just be away from your finger, so that you can actually see where the arrow is. Let's try it. I'll press away from the menu on the canvas. So you'll see here, my arrow, or my finger, appears.
If you'd like to add a new slide, simply press the plus button here at the bottom. New slide. Let's say I want to record everything I'm doing. Let's press record. So now I'm recording not only my writing here, but also my voice. So you'll be able to watch everything I do and everything I say. If I want to save my file, I simply press down here in the bottom right corner. I get to choose what I want to name my file and I'll press save. Now what happens when somebody wants to share that file? Simply press the button next to it and I export my file either as an explain everything file, a video, a PDF, or an image. Thank you for watching my explain everything tutorial. I hope this helped and I hope you enjoyed this video.